The Houston Headhunters have scratched and clawed their way back to 500 with two games left to go. The London Knights, with three games left on their schedule, will claim the North Division if they beat Houston today. Looking to throw on first down, looking for St. Green, but an excellent read gets Houston the ball back. Josh Rowe takes it away. Oh my goodness, you couldn't write this up. I mean, this is better than some, you know, Hollywood script. Wide receivers, three to Burr's right as he's alone in the gun here on third down. Lance over the middle into coverage, batted away and picked off again. This time with room to run down the left-hand sideline. Who? It's Mike Jones. Mike Jones made the interception and he gets a pick six. Three interceptions on three consecutive drives and finally our first point to the ball game. If you are a football fan, this is what you love to see. This gets the pulse up. Uh, great, great defensive football right here. And again, what a fantastic play right there by London. As we said, they needed to anchor down on that coverage, and they did just that. They were showing just how strong their defense was as well. After the Tom Tanner offside call, they'll stretch it near side. Merrill with a good burst of speed, and blockers in front of them. Robert Merrill is loose down the sideline. Touchdown, London. Figure out how to move this football. Five wideouts. Burr gonna go deep down the middle, caught by a wide open Mike St. Green, who is blasted at the 38 yard line. So Tony Roberto and Jacob Creech are your linebackers. Emmanuel Blackman, Brandon Ewing, Mike Jones at corner, Anthony Wyo and Jack Russell at safety. GP, another spin move, and another one with a, with a, to defect a diving defender, and it's another first down on the ground for Houston looking to make a 34 yarder from the right hash for Houston's first points of the ball game the kick is up and through and it's now 14-3 Houston a ton of accolades already to his name looking to add more on here he creeps closer to the 3500 yard mark in the season Merrill goes backward here on first down wow what a great job right there or wide, they're on second and long. Bickler gonna be in the gun, looking to throw over the middle. Picked off by Houston! And the backbone shows itself. J.W. Hartshorn with the interception. Third interception of his rookie campaign here in week 12. As Bird has to fight off the pressure, passing over the middle, finds Mike St. Green to the 40-yard line. To get out there, get your room, and come out and have some fun. Like football game to look forward to and some golfing events. Hand up, Wells, nice spin move, and blockers near side. GP Wells is free, inside the 20, and wrapped up at the 11-yard line. Great pursuit on GP, but Mr. Grand Prix Wells gets another big gain for Houston. Third down, bunch left of Burr, who takes a five-step drop, looking left side, caught by St. Green, looking for the six, he's got it! Touchdown, Houston! Can he do it again here on first downs? He looks to throw again, over the middle again. This time it's picked up! And return the other way, Josh Rowe with his second pick of the ball game. Eight men of the box here for London. They will go up the middle with GP. Gets on a one, gets another good block. He stiff arms a man at the 35 yard line and gets to the 33. It's a great time to be a sports fan. Dog days of summer are fastly approaching. Here's, we are in April 1st of 2023. Pass over the middle, finds the tight end Jim Copeland Jr. and Houston for the second straight drive are back in the red zone. Line I hand off GP through the middle, touchdown, Houston. They've not backed themselves into a corner at all. With a run from Merrill near side, he's got a blocker in front of him, Merrill free again. Inside the 40, he's got one man to beat. He leads forward to the Houston 20. Uh, it's, it's looking that way. Pickler back to pass, and as he throws, Floater is caught. First down inside the five. Under a minute to go, DB show. Pressure on the outside, under 50 to go, pass near side. Finn Kalia gets his first touchdown since week nine against Fort Worth when he had those five touchdowns. It's been a drought for Kalia since then. He gets back on the score sheet. 
A tight ball game. The running game has been working today as they hand off right side to GP Wells. Gets a couple of blocks. And from the get-go, GP Wells is running again. And he gets inside the London 40 down to the 36. And similar look on the line, except the two tailbacks are now in a split back look. Looking to throw his burr with the blitz coming. Looks near side. That shot by Wayne Fulton, the third string tight end. And he gets a first down to London's 22. A very, a very big play. They have to convert here. Uh, this could be a game changer, honestly. They're on four consecutive third downs. Coming off of the second quarter, Wells picks up another first down on third down. It's first and goal from the four. To dime look out of London, stretch play right side, good blocking, and GP will waltz into the end zone for another lead change and another Houston advantage. Who does have those two interceptions today? First and ten this time inside of Houston Field. The Merrill Bobbles picked up. He's got an entourage. Another pick six in the ball game. This time it's in favor of Houston. Zed Markov! Touchdown Headhunters! Oh man, what a great job by Zed Markov. 6'3", 243 pounds in his fourth season. And, uh, you know, let's take a look at this replay. I, I love the replay footage here because we get to take a moment, a moment just dissect and take a look at that. Yeah, a little bit of a bobble there, and that's all it took. As I said, I actually kind of coined this earlier in the game with these interceptions. These guys are playing like they're sharks on a feeding frenzy, almost in the enemy territory. Nickler, deep drop now, deep off, middle toss, high wind, 23-yard line, first down London. For JT Delaney, has not missed a field goal all season long. Kick is up, it is good. He remains perfect. Houston's defense gonna have to play strong, and it's tipped at the punter. It's going to be a short punt. It's corralled. Maybe my London ball is still free. They finally fall on it on the Houston 49-yard line. The pendulum could, could certainly swing. London need a score. A touchdown would tie it. 6-17 to go in the final frame of regulation. Hand off Merrill. Nothing doing. Butch Menner, two-yard loss. Four wide receivers here for Pickler. Just on the other side of midfield. Pickler gonna look to throw. All slants middle. That is caught at the line to gain. They will give it to him. First down, Knights. Now London on another third down. This one from a little bit closer than the one early on the drive. Pickler, middle, first down. Peace not there and shut in time. And London will convert again. And let's get the ball back. I think that's the plan from Liam Crowder there on the London sideline. Kick is up and it is good from Delaney. It's now a four-point ball game here after the two-minute warning. They do have two, not three left for London. Heckler, five-step drop now. Looking middle, that is intercepted! Diedrich Law playing center field. Heckler, six interception, and that puts Houston in field goal range. I love that reference right there, my friend. Uh, talking about playing center field, of course, Houston with these retro th uh, throwback jerseys there. Um, and, and my goodness, what a what a great job. I mean, this team. Final kneel down. It's the Headhunters with the victory here at home against the Johnny Pickler London Knights, 31-27.